to their room. Um, uh, so, uh, right now I'm just thinking about what I'm going to do for the robot in three days. I'm thinking U-shaped base that a cube goes inside. We have a conveyor in the back that brings balls up and they land on the cube. And there's a, um, and there's an arm that can, um, go inside of the cube and somehow lift it up and score. I'm not going to, I don't think we should do a holonomic drive because it's, first off, we need all the motors we have and also, um, with the U-shaped base, I brought, I tried to make some type of X-Drive, and with the wheels sideways, it's just not going to fit and let the cube slide in while still fitting in the dimensions. Uh, and the H-Drive, we would have to put the wheel in the very back, which I've seen people do. It doesn't work that well at all. Okay, we should be in the Here's your work area. Get these two tables here. This isn't in my playlist. Well, I might have accidentally added when I was adding a bunch of Minecraft music. We're making the base of our robot and it's going fairly well. We got everything to fit so we can fit snugly a cube inside of our robot. So if we have a cube in here, then we can have a conveyor in the back that brings the balls up and puts them on a hopper. It drops them into... That drops them into... So it's the end of the first day and I'm pretty happy about what I got done. We need to clean up the table a little bit, but we have a robot. It's beautiful. With a drive that has motors connected to it. It's beautiful. We have some supports. It's beautiful pretty sturdy. We have a mechanism that when we let a cube go in here, drop them in here. Yeah, that's an issue. That's an issue we need to fix. I'm fairly happy about what we did today. Tomorrow I'm hoping to get a conveyor right here so we can start picking up the balls. Fix up this mechanism. Next day, I'll just add the brain and then program it. And then we'll have a completed robot. Let us lift the green cubes up and score them. You still have donut face. What are you doing today? I'm adding the conveyor on and seeing if I need to modify the mechanism that makes sure everything goes in properly without flying everywhere. Uh, and I'm going to hopefully get the arm done. What have you learned so far from robot in three days? So far, <clears throat> I've learned that ro robots that you build in three days are very bad. Uh, <laughs> usually when you start, it, you have no clue what's going to happen, and uh, it, it's, it's just, just it's a prototype. That's, that's, all, that's all I can say. That's all I've learned. What it's is a prototype. Okay, go build. Uh, 
This is Milo update two. Yeah, so over. So it is Milo update uh, two, I think now. While we need more updates. Uh, but uh, let's just show you what we have. We have a robot that has a conveyor with the motor, a drive, and then the ball. Then the ball goes in there, goes up. Roasted. The power move? The power move? We get a cube in here. And we do power move. Kaboom! Power move. Kaboom. Hold up. Kaboom! The other power and move. Then kaboom. And then kaboom. Even and then more. Another power move. And then? And, and then? then oh. Not a power move. Not a power move, but still. It's pretty powerful, honestly, though. It's pretty powerful. Any gonna... competition, gone. We're gonna work on, hopefully we can get rid of this bar so it can go back a little, uh, so it'll, uh, not go up like that, but, uh, I'm super lit. I got you on camera. <laughs> How does all this roboting make you feel? Pretty good. Can you be more descriptive? Nope. <laughs> hey, chillax. Okay. Yeah, What's going on over here? Uh, everything. We don't mind them. We're just we're making uh, an actual robot work. <laughs> Uh, Did you test We're your? I see you got. Work. I see you have your motor plugged in. You tested your conveyor. Yeah, I did. How'd it go? Uh, we need to play around with it a tiny yeah. bit. Uh, it was um. I just need to. I I forget exactly what it's doing. I need to modify. I just know I need to. Okay, let me see your lift. Nice. Oops, wait. There you go. It lifts. It's going to lift the grain cubes up five inches uh, so it can get on two of the three platforms. Nice. The last day, two hours left. Mm -hmm. Down to the lone survivor. Yep. How does it feel to be the last man on the island? Uh. <laughs> Pretty good, I guess. I've been the last man on the island for about At the current moment, it is not perfect, but it will work. Wait. Yeah, there's still a few bugs to work out. A that brings the ball all the way up and scores it. Yay. The pin is in here so it can uh so it can redirect the ball in oh, instead yeah. of going straight forward and rolling down here, it'll redirect it this way and go down here. Once you get that first one in, the other balls are pretty much guaranteed to go in their slot. I think we can say there's still a lot of bugs to work out. Well, that was slow. There's still a few bugs to work out. Well, there's still a few bugs to work out.
has some issues. Okay, so uh, it was a long three days, but I like the result of it. It's a good starting robot. It's fine, whatever. Put a rubber bands on it. Well, there's still a few bugs.